we want to consider the function f of x equals three minus two x squared on the closed interval from negative five to eight. We first want to find the average or mean slope on this interval. Remember the slope is equal to the change of y divided by the change of x, or in our case, the change of the function values divided by the change of x over this closed interval. Then, by the mean value theorem, there exists a c in the open interval from negative five to eight such that f prime of c is equal to the mean slope. Remember, f prime of c would be the slope of the tangent line at x equals c. So we're gonna find the location where the slope of this tangent line would be the same as the mean slope. Before we do this though, let's look at it graphically. Here's the graph of the given function over the closed interval from negative five to eight. The slope of this red tangent line here will be the mean or average slope and then the x value here will be the c, where f prime of c is equal to the average slope. Meaning the slope of this tangent line here has the same slope as this red line here. So let's begin by finding the mean or average slope. So f of eight would be equal to three minus two times eight squared, and then f of negative five would be three minus two times negative five squared. That's the change of y, or the change of the function values, divided by eight minus negative five becomes eight plus five, or thirteen. And to save some time, three minus two times eight squared is negative one hundred twenty-five. And then minus three minus two times negative five squared is equal to negative forty-seven and divide all this by 13. Notice how this becomes plus 47, so this ends up being negative 78 divided by 13, which is equal to negative six. So the mean or average slope over this closed interval for our function f of x is negative six. So now to find c such that f prime of c is equal to negative six, we'll find our derivative function set it equal to negative six and solve for x. So again, if f of x equals three minus two x squared, then f prime of x is gonna be equal to, the derivative of three would be zero, the derivative of negative two x squared would be negative four x. So to find the value of c in this open interval, we wanna determine when negative four x is equal to negative six. Well, if we divide both sides by negative four, we have x equals, this would be six fourths or three halves. Therefore, f prime of three halves would be equal to negative six, and therefore, to answer this question, c is equal to three halves. If we go back and take a look at our graph again, Notice how the x value for this point of tangency here is three halves. And notice how the slope of the tangent line is the same as this mean or average slope of this red line. I hope you found this explanation helpful.